Hey guys, welcome back to Cocktail Cards. Today we're gonna to show you how to make the Gin Gimlet. Now this drink was originally used for sailors who were getting scurvy. And of course scurvy is a vitamin C deficiency. So of course they put together this little mixture and they added gin in it to really help entice the sailors to drink this often so that they wouldn't catch scurvy. And of course it became a really popular cocktail. It's actually very simple, but very, very delicious. Often a fan favorite. I've made thousands of these and they're pretty darn good. So let's go ahead and jump into the ingredients for the Gimlet. First of all, we will need a gin. I'm gonna be going with Bell Ringer here. It's a London Dry, has good citrus tones to it. Uh, very easy drinking gin, so I'm gonna use that. Also a really, really good budget gin as well. So if you do find this, uh, pretty affordable and a pretty solid flavor to it. Uh, next, we need some simple syrup. That's gonna be one part sugar, one part water. And lastly, we're gonna need a lime for some fresh squeezed lime juice, and we're also gonna garnish this with a lime wheel as well. So let's go ahead and jump in and show you how to make the gimlet. So this cocktail will be shaken, so let's go ahead and build this out in our pint glass or our shaker. And the very first thing we're gonna do is add two ounces of our gin. We're gonna follow that up with three quarters of an ounce of simple syrup. Go ahead and grab your lime. We're gonna squeeze out three quarters of an ounce of fresh lime juice. All right, now we're ready to add some ice. We're gonna give this drink a shake for about eight to 10 seconds. So you can serve this drink in a martini glass or a coupe glass. I already have a coupe glass that was chilling in the fridge, so I'm gonna use that, and then we're just gonna double strain our drink into the glass. Now we wanna double strain this drink, make sure we're not getting any ice shards into our glass here. Lastly, we need to cut up a lime wheel for a garnish. So we're just gonna go straight down on this with our knife. Now you can take the lime and actually put it into your drink and let it just kind of float on top. I like to cut a little slit in the line here and rest it on the side. So you got a nice lime wheel on the side of your glass there. And there you go, the gin gimlet. Mm. That's really good. You get this perfect balance of sweet tones and tart tones. You get the gin really adding in a little herbal, a little complexity to the drink. And yeah, it's very simple, but awesome flavors. Very well balanced. I could see how it could fool sailors into consuming their limes. It is super, super tasty. I know this is a fan favorite. I've made this thousands of times. Perfect, perfect for a warm weather day. You can just throw these down one after another. They're pretty darn tasty, the gin gimlet. Hey, thanks for tuning into the Gin Gimlet recipe. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give us a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to the channel. We're gonna be coming out with way over a hundred different recipes on this channel, so you're not gonna wanna miss those. And yeah, that's it. Hopefully you give the Gimlet a try. It is absolutely delicious. And I'm AJ with Cocktail Cards. I'll catch you in the next one.